Hey everybody, it's Dean DeCosta of the Search Theory, and today we're looking at a tool called Dork GPT. Now, let me explain. Google dorking is Boolean. Um, it's kind of more, they say it's more advanced. In some ways it is, some ways it's not. Um, it's used a lot, the word dork is used a lot when it comes to OSINT and stuff like that. And so, um, we're going to see what it does. So, first thing, it's just like any G GPT, type what you want. Okay. Um, now, first thing, keep in mind, if you have a speech to text working with the creator, you can use it and just say what you want. I mean, the interesting thing about all GPTs, everybody's like, you got to write this, you got to write that, you got to have this, you got to have that. Basically, if you know how to use natural language, which you should by now, because it is a recruiting tool of sorts, um, you can do GPT because that's really all of it, natural language. So I'm going to say, find resumes of java developers i don't know why i just like picking on java developers that's what i'm going to say and then i'm going to go over here and generate it's going to generate and it's saying site linkedin.com java developer okay cool and we're going to go ahead and open up and search and you're going to find it didn't get anything now the reason it didn't get anything is because despite what it said it forgot a couple of important things there should be a space after the linkedin I did that it would have worked um, I'm not gonna sit here wait forever for it to figure it out I'm just gonna go ahead and get off it so the dork GBT can work for some things but you gotta be really specific about what you want so we're gonna try this again um, x-ray into LinkedIn for developer that's all I'm gonna put x-ray in, into LinkedIn for developer now let's see what it does site calling linkedin.com space developer so we got this right and now we're getting what we want all right so now we know we have to be a little more specific now how is it any different than normal gpt truth be told it's not they're calling it dork gpt truthfully it's not uh it's ex exactly the same it works the same differences are number one um you can tell it it, it it's free um there's no wait um, it can be found at dorkgpt.com and then you can search straight from here. You don't have to copy and paste. You just search and it will search. So that's where it comes in handy. Um, I would play with it more. I have played with it more and there are some things it does really, really, really well. Some things it doesn't do as well, like with any GPT. Um, but that's really about it. But uh, it's called dorkgpt. You get at dorkgpt.com really not the different that much different than any of the gbt garbage in garbage out so make sure you know what you're looking for but pretty much natural language x-ray into linkedin for developer there you go all right this is dean DeCosta of the search authority may the source be with you